Hi guys and welcome to our channel Only in Australia where you can find travel, adventure, food and culture that is unique to Australia's shores. Chimori, um, the dairy farm and uh, dairy eatery uh, in Indonesia. It's kind of on the way to Tandem Safari and um, we're on our way home. Uh, it's famous for, uh, yeah, people coming to try fresh milk. Fresh milk's a bit of a deal in Asia, a real deal, and um, the ice cream here is quite amazing. Um, over here is a kind of a farm area, although I have never actually been down there to see any of the cows or anything like that. It's quite a lot of pollution, but um, it's it's quite a famous place here. Here's the team. There's Nashi One. Nashi Two is asleep right now. There's Nashi One here. Nashi Three and Nashi Four. And there's the balcony where I once famously flicked ice cream onto some huge guy, actually that could be him over there, the black shirt, uh, who had no neck uh, after he kept blowing smoke up here all over our kids and I got him with ice cream, he thought a bird had done a, um, yes, well, was that wrong? I'm not sure, but, uh, yes, but um, anyway, I'll have a look over the side and see if I can see any cows, hold on. Go to live now to Phil. He's here. Yeah. Phil, have you got anything you'd like to say? Okay, 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 okay. Phil? Hi. Anything you want to say? Hi. To the camera? Hi. Excellent. And that was live from Phil, and uh, I couldn't have said that better myself. Let's uh, now go and um, yeah. looking at yeah. Mummy and Cassie. That was well said as well. Excellent. They have played ground downstairs. Do they? Ah, uh, yeah, we'll probably be heading off. We're going to eat it. Oh, Hi, guys. We are going to have a uh, tape goreng. It's um, fermented cassava fritter. So, they put flour and they fry it. And it's usually very sweet. And these are the toppings. It has cheese, peanut, uh, chocolate sprinkles. Uh, I think this is melted cheese and this is like chocolate jam. It's very yummy. I love it so much. Enjoy! Okay, so I'm going to try uh, the Indonesian banana split. So I've got... Um, let's see, I've got a cherry and I've got some nuts here. Some banana down the bottom, a chocolate wafer or two, some sauce. And no cream, which is funny. It looks like Neapolitan, so I'm going to try it. See how we go. Strawberry. Yeah, definitely strawberry ice cream. Can you keep your feet? Just leaving Chimori, and um, yeah, what can I say? Um, <laughs> well, we're just in a bit of a parking jam, getting out before the uh, traffic all comes out of Tan and Safari, which will uh, make our trip hours longer, this some 90 kilometers. But um, yeah, it's good in there. I like it. The look, the banana split. What can I say? A little bit disappointing, but there's not much I can say about it. The place is nice, it's annoying in some way. I'm just nearly running over the parking there. So look, this is why you need parking men in Indonesia. Look at this. So without a parking man, you just don't get out. So this is why we have one. 
and then when the traffic slows down, you have to step in the way. Everyone will stop, and there he goes, and then we go. Now the problem is getting over the other side, and that's not so bad. And we're on our way. Otherwise, we'd be there for half an hour. Um, yeah, what can I say about the place? Mm. Yeah, look, it's different to last time. Last time was a little bit better. I guess we ordered different stuff. Look at this guy. And it, the drinks, yeah, they're a bit watery and um, they tasted nice. They were a bit watery on the bottom. And the banana split, I could take or leave it. it there was no cream, it wasn't anything special, it honestly tasted like ice cream from Aldi, um, just with a couple of bits of garnish on there, so yeah, I mean seriously, I could have taken or left that. Um, in Indonesia, things like that are not expensive, the banana split was like $3, it's no big deal. Um, not like uh, the big banana where they're like $20 or something like that, um, but yeah. I. It's special for the people that are here. Would I make a trip out from Jakarta for a day to go? They know I wouldn't. Not, not at all. Um, if I were going to Tanim Safari, um, yeah, I'd stop. And uh, I'd order something different next time. <laughs> Some hot food, I think. And uh, yeah, and a better creamy milk drink rather than a fruit drink. But um, yeah, it's, uh, it's not something I would leave town to do. So out of uh, 10, I'm going to give it, um, for another reason, it, the place does have a non-smoking area, but we moved because people were smoking, and here in this country, it's a real pest. I mean, it just happens nearly everywhere, and people just don't understand why someone will get up and move, they really don't get it. And it's not a rudeness or, uh, uh, you know, pointing something out, but it's just, um, yeah, it's just, uh, no thanks. It's just kind of, yeah, they don't understand why people object to it. And, yeah, even in the non-smoking bit, it just wafts in. So out of 10, I'm going to give that place. I'm going to give the whole place. I'm going to give it 5.5. So for me, yeah, no, it's a no. I wouldn't do it again unless I was right next door. <laughs>